If you can think it, you can get it. Written by Kelvin W. Nathan. Published by Audiobooks Office. Introduction. Simply imagine being able to bring your thoughts to life, turning your wildest dreams into actual accomplishments. Imagine if you could unlock all your desires in life just by tapping into the incredible potential of your mind. Introducing If You Can Think It, You Can Get What You Want, a manuscript that will guide you in harnessing the incredible power of your thoughts to shape your own destiny. Ever thought about why some people seem to effortlessly achieve their goals while others struggle, despite putting in the same amount of effort? Often, the key to understanding lies not in what they do, but in how they think. It's important to understand that your thoughts hold immense power, perhaps more than you're aware of. Discover the power of this book as it leads you on a journey to master your thoughts. Learn how to harness their potential and channel them towards success, abundance, and fulfillment. We begin by exploring the fundamental principle that thoughts are the seeds of reality. Every invention, every achievement, every great success story began as a thought in someone's mind. This book will help you understand how your thoughts influence your reality, shaping the opportunities you encounter, the decisions you make, and the outcomes you experience. By learning to control and direct your thoughts, you can create the life you've always wanted. The first step in this journey is to recognize the power of belief. Your beliefs are the filters through which you perceive the world, and they have a profound impact on what you think is possible. This book provides practical exercises to help you identify and challenge limiting beliefs that hold you back. You'll learn how to replace them with empowering beliefs that open up new possibilities and set the stage for success. In If You Can Think It, You Can Get What You Want, you'll find inspiring ideas of individuals who have transformed their lives by mastering their thoughts. These real-life examples demonstrate that by believing in the power of your mind, you can overcome obstacles, achieve your goals, and live a life that exceeds your wildest dreams. Their journeys will inspire you to take action and apply these principles in your own life. This book has been created with a focus on clarity, practicality, and immediate applicability. Every chapter provides practical steps and exercises that you can begin implementing immediately. Whether you're starting out on your path of self-improvement or aiming to elevate your success, you'll discover valuable insights that will deeply connect with you. As you start on this journey, keep in mind that your thoughts have the power to shape your reality. When you really focus your thoughts and approach them with intention and purpose, there's no limit to what you can achieve. Imagine possessing the ability to mold reality with your thoughts as if you've got some magical mental wand. Well, you're closer to this than you might believe. You see, your thoughts hold immense power they can create, change, and shape your life in ways you've possibly never considered. This discussion will guide you on how to tap into this latent power, exploring key techniques like visualization, positive affirmations, and challenging limiting beliefs. Are you ready to begin transforming your thought patterns and consequently your life? For more information about the ebook version of this audio, check the video description or visit audiobooksoffice.com. We notice that 69% of you who listen to our video are not yet subscribed to the channel. Please help support the channel by hitting the subscribe button and liking the video. Thanks for inspiring us to create more content for you. Chapter 1 Unveiling the Primacy of Thought Beneath the surface of your conscious mind lies the boundless power of thought, a force so potent that it can shape your reality and bring your wildest dreams within your grasp. It's not just about wishful thinking, but about harnessing the true potential of your mind. This isn't a secret held by a select few, but a universal truth waiting for your discovery. Your thoughts aren't random, but the seeds of your reality. Every achievement, Every failure, every moment of joy or sorrow is born from the cradle of your thoughts. What you think you become, what you feel you attract, and what you imagine you create, it's a principle embedded in the fabric of existence, an axiom of life. 
You've become accustomed to underestimating the power of your thoughts, relegating them to mere mental activity. But they're much more. They're the architects of your destiny, the sculptors of your world. Every thought you entertain, whether consciously or subconsciously, sets the course of your life. Now, it's time to seize control, to steer the ship of your thoughts towards the shores of your dreams. It's no easy task. It requires discipline, commitment, and a strong will. But the rewards are worth it. Imagine a life where your desires aren't just dreams, but tangible realities. It's not a pipe dream, but a potential reality, if you're willing to take the first step. Chapter 2. Mastering the Art of Visualization To truly harness the power of your thoughts and turn dreams into reality, you must become a virtuoso in the art of visualization. This isn't mere daydreaming, but a focused, deliberate exercise of your imagination, a vivid mental blueprint of your goals. Imagine you're a movie director, your mind, a theater. Every day, you're filming a scene where you're the star achieving your aspirations. The key is to make this mental movie so real that it's indistinguishable from reality. Feel the emotions, taste the success, hear the applause. Be in that moment. Visualization isn't wishful thinking, but a powerful tool used by top athletes, successful entrepreneurs, and influential leaders worldwide. It's about deceiving your brain into believing you've already achieved your goals, consequently igniting a fire within you to make it a reality. Start small. Visualize simple tasks first, like finishing a book or acing a presentation. Feel the sense of accomplishment, then move on to bigger dreams. The more you practice, the better you'll get, and soon you'll notice your actions aligning with your visualizations. Remember, the mind can't distinguish between what's real and what's imagined. So dream big, visualize with all your might, and let your mind do the heavy lifting. The power of visualization is real. Master it and watch as your thoughts transform into tangible actions and ultimately into the reality you've always dreamed of. Don't just think it, see it. Your future is waiting. All you've got to do is visualize. Chapter 3 Harnessing the Power of Affirmations Just as visualization taps into the power of your mind, Affirmations serve as your personal cheerleader, reinforcing your self-belief and fueling your journey towards your dreams. They're not magic spells, but potent tools harnessing the power of positive thinking, shaping your reality from the inside out. You may be wondering, what are affirmations, simply put? They're positive statements you repeat to yourself, designed to challenge and overcome negative thoughts. You're not just speaking into the wind, you're instructing your subconscious mind, filling it with confidence, resilience, and the belief that you can achieve what you've set your mind on. Identify your goals. What do you want to achieve? Then, craft affirmations that align with those goals. Make them precise, positive, and in the present tense. Instead of saying, I want to be a successful writer, say, I am a successful writer, do you feel the difference? Repeat your affirmations daily. Speak them, write them, meditate upon them. Make them your mantra and let them guide your actions and decisions. You're creating a blueprint for success in your subconscious mind, a roadmap to your dreams. Chapter 4. Overcoming Limiting Beliefs and Doubts While harnessing the power of affirmations can give you a boost, you'll also need to tackle those nagging doubts and limiting beliefs that can stifle your progress towards your dreams. It's essential to remember that your thoughts are like seeds, and each one has the potential to either grow into a flourishing tree or wither away unfruitfully. Now, you might ask, how can I overcome these limiting beliefs and doubts? The key lies in your willingness to challenge and change them. You have to acknowledge first that these limiting beliefs are just that beliefs, not facts. They're perceptions you formed based on past experiences and societal conditioning. Start by identifying your limiting beliefs. They could be thoughts like I'm not good enough, 
or I can't do this. Once you've recognized them, question their validity. Are these beliefs supporting your growth or are they holding you back? Next, replace these limiting beliefs with empowering ones. For example, change I can't do this to I can and I will. This isn't just about positive thinking. It's about shifting your mindset to align with your aspirations. Finally, practice resilience. There'll be times when doubts creep in, but don't let them dictate your actions. Persevere with confidence, knowing you're capable of achieving your dreams. Chapter 5 Cultivating a Mindset of Abundance Cultivating a mindset of abundance isn't merely about having an optimistic outlook, it's about truly believing in your capacity for growth, success, and fulfillment. You've got to understand that you have the potential to create a life filled with richness, not just materially but also emotionally, spiritually, and intellectually. Start by acknowledging your self-worth. Don't let anyone, not even yourself, belittle your abilities or achievements. You're capable of more than you can imagine. Appreciate the value you bring and the unique gifts you possess. Remember, you're second to none. Next, surround yourself with positive influences. Your environment plays a significant role in shaping your mindset. Find people who uplift you, encourage you, and inspire you to be better. Their positivity will rub off on you, boosting your belief in abundance. Moreover, focus on the opportunities, not the obstacles. Life is full of challenges, but they're not meant to stop you. They're there to strengthen you and prime you for success. When you start seeing challenges as stepping stones, you'll realize how every situation holds the potential for growth. Finally, practice gratitude. Appreciate every bit of good in your life, however small. Gratitude not only makes you happier, but also opens up your mind to more goodness, creating a cycle of positivity and abundance. And remember, the abundance mindset isn't a destination, it's a journey. It's a continuous process of self-growth and self-improvement. Start today, and you'll be amazed at how far you can go. Chapter 6 Tapping into the Subconscious Mind Trigger the power of your subconscious mind, a treasure trove of untapped potential, to transform your dreams into reality. This hidden gem within you is a reservoir of creativity, intuition, and profound wisdom. Don't let it lie dormant. Liberate it, engage it, and watch your life transform. Start by feeding your subconscious positive affirmations. It's crucial to believe in the power of your thoughts. Every thought you think plants a seed in your subconscious. If you constantly think, I can't, your subconscious will believe it. But if you affirm, I can and I will, your subconscious will work tirelessly to make it happen. Visualization is another powerful tool. Your subconscious doesn't recognize the difference between reality and imagination. When you imagine your dreams as reality, your subconscious works diligently to align your reality with these images. Spend a few quiet moments each day visualizing the success you desire. Picture it vividly in your mind and let your subconscious do the rest. You might be wondering about the scientific foundation of thought manifestation and how it operates at a neurological level. You're not alone, it's a fascinating field and it's teeming with potential. Every thought you have sparks a neural pathway in your brain. That thought, whether positive or negative, is like a seed, and the more you cultivate it, the stronger it grows. Imagine your brain as a fertile garden. Each thought is a seed that you plant, and your attention and belief are the water and sunlight that cause it to thrive. The more attention you give a specific thought, the more robust the neural pathway becomes, eventually forming a belief. This is the science of neuroplasticity, the brain's capacity to rewire itself, to form and strengthen neural pathways based on your thoughts and experiences. Now, let's connect this with manifestation. Your brain doesn't distinguish between reality and imagination. 
When you visualize your desires as if they're already achieved, your brain builds neural pathways supporting this reality. This process aligns your mindset, emotions, and actions with your aspirations, consequently increasing the chance of achieving them. Chapter 7. Developing a Powerful Mental Focus Harnessing the power of your mind begins with developing a laser-sharp mental focus, a key to unshackling the door to your dreams and aspirations. You've got to train your mind to concentrate on a single task, goal, or thought, just like an athlete trains their muscles for a sport. This isn't easy, but it's necessary. It's about more than just blocking out distractions. It's about directing your energy, your passion, and your intellect towards a single point. Let's look at how to do this. Understand your mind is like a wild horse. It will wander if not guided. So start by setting clear, specific goals. The more specific the goal, the easier it's for your mind to focus on it. This isn't the time for vague aspirations you need concrete, definable objectives. Next, practice mindfulness. Be present, be in the moment. When you're eating, eat. When you're reading, read. Don't let your mind wander to other tasks or worries. This is about training your mind to stay on task. As you journey towards making your thoughts a reality, aligning your emotions with your aspirations plays a pivotal role, acting as the fuel that propels your dreams into existence. Think of your emotions as a compass, guiding you towards your desired future. When you feel excited, motivated, and passionate about your goals, you're on the right track. Conversely, if your aspirations bring about feelings of dread, doubt, or discomfort, it's a signal to reassess and realign. Now, you might ask, how do I align my thoughts with my emotions? The answer lies within you. It starts with self-awareness. You've got to recognize your emotional reactions to your thoughts and dreams. Do they bring joy or stress? If it's the latter, don't fret. It's not about masking your genuine feelings with forced positivity. Instead, it's about adjusting your aspirations until they ignite a spark of excitement within you. Next, harness the power of visualization. Picture yourself achieving your goals. Feel the thrill, the satisfaction, the pride. Let these emotions seep into your consciousness. This emotional connection not only makes the journey enjoyable, but also motivates you to stay the course. Lastly, practice gratitude. Appreciate your progress, no matter how small. Celebrate your victories, however insignificant they seem. This attitude of gratitude nurtures positive emotions, further aligning your thoughts with your aspirations. Chapter 8. Transforming Challenges into Opportunities Every challenge you face carries the potential to become an extraordinary opportunity for growth and progress. It's not just a cliché, it's an undeniable truth. But how do you transform these challenges into opportunities? It's simpler than you think. First, you need to shift your mindset. Instead of viewing challenges as burdens, see them as opportunities waiting to be discovered. Yes, it's hard, but it's not impossible. You've got what it takes to turn your trials into triumphs. Next, start by identifying the lesson in every challenge. What can you learn from it? How can it make you better? Instead of focusing on the problem, concentrate on the solution. This isn't about ignoring the issue but rather about finding a way to turn it into something positive. Remember, the power of thought is incredible. You can literally shape your reality with your mind. When you believe in your ability to overcome challenges, you're already halfway there. So believe in yourself. Believe in your power to transform obstacles into stepping stones. Chapter 9 Fostering a Gratitude-Driven Perspective while transforming challenges into opportunities is key, cultivating a sense of gratitude can further propel you on your journey to make your dreams a reality. Gratitude, you see, isn't just about being thankful for the good things in your life, but also about finding the silver linings in your struggles. This mindset can shift your perspective and open doors to new possibilities. Think about it when you're grateful, you're focusing on the positive aspects of your life rather than the negative. 
This shift in focus can alter your thought patterns, moving you away from a scarcity mindset towards one of abundance. With a gratitude-driven perspective, you can see the glass as half full, empowering you to approach your journey with optimism and resilience. To cultivate this mindset, it's vital to start a daily gratitude practice. Each day, take a few moments to reflect on what you're thankful for. It can be as simple as a warm cup of coffee in the morning or as profound as the love of your family. Write these down in a gratitude journal. This practice not only sets a positive tone for the day, but also reprograms your mind to seek out and focus on the good. Chapter 10. Unleashing Creativity Through Thought Control Harnessing the power of your mind, you can tap into a fountain of creativity by mastering control over your thoughts. Your thoughts are powerful. They're the architects of your reality. By learning to steer them in the right direction, you'll discover a world of untapped potential. Start by practicing mindfulness. Stay present in each moment, and you'll notice a sharper awareness of your inner dialogue. What messages are you repeating to yourself? Are they limiting or empowering? Cultivating a positive mindset is crucial, not just for the sake of optimism, but to foster the right conditions for creativity to flourish. Next, embrace the power of visualization. Picture in vivid detail what you want to create. See it, feel it, inhabit it in your mind. This mental rehearsal primes your brain to generate the ideas and insights necessary for its materialization. Finally, don't be afraid to challenge your thought patterns. Question your ideas, push your boundaries. Creativity thrives on exploration and curiosity. It's not always about finding the right answer sometimes, it's about asking the right questions. Remember, your thoughts aren't static, they're dynamic and malleable. You have the power to shape them, to redirect them towards creativity and innovation. It's a skill, and like any skill, it requires practice. So, stay patient, stay persistent. The journey may be challenging, but the rewards are limitless. You are the master of your mind. Now it's time to let your creativity shine. Chapter 11. The Interconnectedness of Mind and Body You're not just a mind and a body, but a beautifully complex system where your thoughts and physiology are deeply intertwined, each influencing the other in profound ways. It's a dance of the mind and body, each responding and adapting to the other. Your thoughts can guide your body's actions, and your physical state can shape your mental processes. This isn't some esoteric concept, but a scientifically proven fact. When you're physically active, for example, your mind feels sharper, more focused. That's because exercise stimulates the release of chemicals in your brain that enhance cognitive functions. On the flip side, chronic stress, which originates in the mind, can manifest in your body as headaches, insomnia, or even serious health conditions like heart disease. It's clear that your thoughts and your body's health are inseparable. Understanding this interconnectedness is pivotal because it empowers you to take control of your well-being. By harnessing your thoughts, you can influence your physical health and vice versa. Imagine the possibilities. Every thought could become a tool for improving your health and overall quality of life. This isn't just about preventing illness or being physically fit. It's about holistic wellness that encompasses your mental and physical essentialness. So embrace this interconnectedness, use it to your advantage. Once you realize that your mind and body aren't separate entities but part of a powerful, integrated system, you'll open a new door to personal growth and achievement. Chapter 12 Strategies for Overcoming Mental Blocks Everyone encounters mental blocks, those intimidating barriers in your mind that hinder progress, but with the right strategies, you can conquer them and tap into your full potential. Don't let these blocks stop you. They're temporary, and you're capable of overcoming them. Firstly, don't shy away from them. Face them head on. Identify what's causing the block. 
Is it fear, stress, or lack of inspiration? Once you identify the root cause, you can address it effectively. Secondly, remember that it's okay to take a break. Sometimes your mind just needs a little rest. Stepping away can provide a fresh perspective when you return to the task. You're not wasting time, you're recharging your mental batteries. Thirdly, don't isolate yourself. Reach out to others. Share your thoughts and concerns. You'd be surprised how a different perspective can provide a new approach to a problem. Lastly, practice mindfulness. Stay present in the moment instead of worrying about the future or dwelling on the past. This can help clear your mind and allow new ideas to flow in. Chapter 13. Embracing a holistic approach to wellness. Moving beyond mental blocks, holistic wellness comes into play, offering a thorough approach to maintaining not just your mental health, but also physical, emotional, and spiritual well-being. Starting with the physical, it's crucial to keep your body in top form through regular exercise, balanced nutrition, and adequate sleep. These aren't just good habits, they're non-negotiable investments in your well-being. Emotionally, aim to foster positive relationships, express your feelings authentically, and cultivate resilience in the face of adversity. Emotions aren't meant to be suppressed, but acknowledged, understood, and managed. Spiritually, it's about finding your purpose, connecting with something larger than yourself, and staying true to your values. It's not necessarily about religion, but more about inner peace, mindfulness, and fulfillment. Lastly, mental wellness is integral. Keep your brain sharp and your mind open. Encourage creativity, practice mindfulness, and engage in activities that challenge and stimulate you mentally. Holistic wellness consequently, isn't a single act but a lifestyle. It's about acknowledging that every component of your being is interconnected and a shift in one area can profoundly impact the others. It's about balance, harmony, and a commitment to nurturing every aspect of yourself. Chapter 14. Aligning Thoughts with Desired Outcomes Harnessing the Power of Your Thoughts Imagine aligning them with your desired outcomes, a practice that can transform your reality and propel you towards your goals. This isn't wishful thinking. It's about paving the way for success and fulfillment in your life. The alignment of thoughts with your aspirations is a force multiplier, enhancing your abilities and propelling you towards your goals. Start by identifying what you truly desire. Imagine yourself achieving that goal in vivid detail. Feel the joy, pride, and satisfaction. Immerse yourself in this visualization and let it seep into your thoughts. This isn't just about dreaming, it's about becoming. You're not merely hoping for outcome, you're aligning your thoughts towards it. Your thoughts wield immense power. They shape your perspective and influence your actions. It's vital. Hence, to keep them positive and focused. When negative thoughts creep in, don't ignore them, but acknowledge them and replace them with positive affirmations. It's like programming your mind for success. The process of aligning thoughts is a journey, not a destination. It requires patience, belief, and practice. Every day, take time to visualize your desired outcomes and align your thoughts accordingly. This practice will become second nature and you'll notice a shift in your mindset, behavior, and ultimately your reality. Chapter 15. Harnessing the Law of Attraction. As you align your thoughts with your desires, you naturally tap into the Law of Attraction, a powerful universal law that can substantially amplify your journey towards achieving your goals. The Law of Attraction works on the principle of like attracts like, meaning that you have the ability to attract into your life whatever you're focusing on. It's not just a myth or a mystical theory, but a phenomenon that's backed by science, particularly quantum physics. Imagine your mind as a magnet, pulling towards you what you think about most. Your thoughts, charged with emotion, become energy, and this energy attracts its likeness. So if you spend time visualizing your goals, 
and feeling like they're already yours, you'll attract them into your life. It's not magic, but a practice of mindful thinking and optimism. But remember, merely thinking about something isn't enough. You must believe in it, live it, and act as if it's already yours. The power of belief is vital in making the law of attraction work. Negativity, doubt, or disbelief can cloud your thoughts, making it harder for you to manifest your desires. So clear your mind, believe in your dreams, and let the law of attraction bring them into reality. Harnessing the law of attraction is more than a one-time event. It's a journey, a constant practice of aligning your thoughts and emotions with your desires. Embrace this journey and watch your dreams turn into reality. Chapter 16 Cultivating Patience and Persistence in Manifestation Often, the key to manifesting your desires lies not only in positive thinking, but also in the unwavering patience and persistent effort you invest in your journey. It's not enough to merely think positive thoughts you need to be patient and persistent in your efforts to make those thoughts a reality. It's a process that requires time, effort, and an unwavering belief in your ability to achieve what you desire. Imagine your desires as seeds. You need to plant these seeds in the fertile soil of your mind, but that's not enough. Just as a seed needs water and sunlight to grow, your desires need your patience and persistence. You must consistently nurture your desires, giving them the time and space they need to grow and flourish. Patience is about understanding that good things take time. It's about trusting in the process and not rushing the outcome. Persistence, on the other hand, is about never giving up. It's about pushing through the obstacles and setbacks that inevitably come your way. It's about staying focused and committed, no matter how long it takes or how hard it gets. Chapter 17 The Role of Visualization in Goal Achievement Believe it or not, visualization plays a pivotal role in turning your dreams into reality. Imagine your goals vividly and with passion, and you'll be amazed at the power this simple act holds. It's not some mystical concept, but a proven psychological technique that can prepare your mind for success. Think about it. When you vividly imagine achieving your goals, you're fundamentally training your brain for success. Like a world-class athlete visualizing the perfect performance, you're developing the mental fortitude necessary to turn your dreams into reality. You're creating a mental blueprint for your success, and every small detail you add makes it more real. But how do you effectively visualize your goals? Start by setting aside quiet, uninterrupted time each day. Close your eyes and imagine your goal as if it's already accomplished. Feel the emotions you'd experience, see the people congratulating you, smell the environment around you. Make it as real as possible. Chapter 18 Unlocking the Potential of Positive Self-Talk Regularly practicing positive self-talk can profoundly transform your mindset and propel you towards achieving your ultimate dreams. It's an underused tool that we all have at our disposal, ready to tap into our potential. You might be wondering how something so simple could be so impactful. Well, it's all about harnessing the power of your thoughts. Imagine your brain as an untamed jungle filled with wild thoughts, anxieties, and fears. Positive self-talk is the machete that cuts through that clutter, paving a clear path toward your aspirations. It's a strong weapon that battles against the negativity and self-doubt that often hold you back. So how do you go about it? Start by becoming your own best cheerleader. Whenever you face a challenge or a setback, Instead of succumbing to crippling self-doubt, tell yourself, I've got this. I can handle it. Remind yourself of past successes and victories. You've done it before, and you'll do it again. But just saying the words isn't enough. You've got to really believe them. Internalize them. Make them a part of who you are. And when you do that, you'll find that you're not just saying, I can do this, you're living it. You're embodying it. 
and that's when the real magic happens. Chapter 19 Balancing Logical Thinking and Intuitive Insights In pursuit of your dreams, striking the right balance between logical thinking and intuitive insights can be a game changer. It's not about choosing one over the other, but rather learning to dance between the two, allowing them to feed one another. Logical thinking is your roadmap, the rational part of your mind that weighs options, analyzes scenarios, and makes informed decisions. It's your ability to reason, to solve problems, and to plan for the future. It keeps you grounded, ensuring you don't lose sight of reality. On the other hand, intuitive insights are like your compass, the subtle whispers of your inner self that guide you towards your true north. It's the gut feeling that nudges you in a certain direction, even when logic might suggest otherwise. It's the creative spark that ignites innovation, the fuel for your imagination, and the source of your unique perspective. To balance the two, you must learn to trust both. Respect your logical mind for its analytical prowess, but don't neglect your intuition, for it holds wisdom beyond reasoning. Practice mindfulness to tune into your intuition and stay open to its signals. At the same time, hone your critical thinking skills to effectively process and interpret the information you receive. In this dance, there's no lead or follow, only harmony. So, trust your logic, listen to your intuition, and embrace the journey of making everything you think come true. Remember, it's not about being right or wrong but about being true to yourself. This balance is your key to tapping into the power of thought. Chapter 20 Adapting Thought Patterns to Different Situations Mastering the art of adapting your thought patterns to different situations can reveal unprecedented levels of success and personal fulfillment. This isn't a mystical art or an unreachable goal, it's a practical skill that you can develop with practice and patience. It's about learning to adjust your mindset and approach, depending on the circumstances you're facing. Consider how a chameleon changes its skin to blend with its environment. Similarly, you need to adapt your thought patterns to match the situation at hand. If you're dealing with a challenging problem at work, your thought pattern should be analytical and solution-focused. If you're spending time with loved ones, your thoughts should be centered on empathy and connection. To successfully adapt your thought patterns, you need to be aware of your thoughts. Pay attention to your thought process. Is it serving you well in the current situation? If not, what can you change? Remember, you have the power to control your thoughts. You also need to practice flexibility. Life is dynamic and so should be your thinking. What works in one situation may not work in another. Thus, be prepared to shift your thinking when required. Lastly, don't be too hard on yourself. Adapting your thought patterns isn't about achieving perfection. It's about growth and improvement. So celebrate your progress, no matter how small. With time, you'll find that you're better equipped to handle different situations, and that's when you'll truly see the power of your thoughts. Chapter 21 Incorporating Meditation and Mindfulness Practices Embrace the transformative power of meditation and mindfulness, for these practices can profoundly shape your thought patterns, paving the way towards turning your thoughts into reality. Meditation allows you to quieten the noise and distractions of the external world, helping you focus on the power of your thoughts. Mindfulness, on the other hand, encourages you to live in the present moment, accepting it without judgment. This combination is a potent tool in helping you direct your thoughts towards desired outcomes. Meditation is a mental workout. It's your dedicated time to train your brain. Just like physical exercise, it's not a quick fix, so don't rush for results. Start with short, focused sessions just five minutes a day can be transformative you'll gradually notice a change in your thought patterns, a shift towards more positive, productive, and creative thinking. Mindfulness is your all-day mental diet. 
It's about being aware of your thoughts, feelings, and surrounding environment throughout the day. It's not about emptying your mind, but rather about observing without judgment. This awareness helps you recognize negative thought patterns and allows you to consciously replace them with more beneficial ones. Chapter 22 Fostering a Supportive Mindset for Success Nurturing a mindset geared towards success is a vital ingredient in making your thoughts a reality. Success isn't just about the destination, it's about the journey, and your mindset is the vehicle that drives you forward. It's a powerful tool that can shape your reality, influencing how you view your abilities, interpret situations and respond to challenges. Imagine your mind as a garden. If you plant seeds of positivity, nurture them with affirmations, water them with resilience, and give them sunlight in the form of hope, you'll reap a bountiful harvest of success. But if you let weeds of doubt and negativity take root, they'll choke your potential and leave you struggling to thrive. So how do you foster a supportive mindset? Start by embracing a growth mindset. Believe in your capacity to learn, grow, and improve. Understand that failure isn't a dead end, but a stepping stone to success. Practice self-compassion and patience, recognizing that progress takes time. Next, surround yourself with positivity. This includes positive people who inspire and uplift you, as well as filling your mental space with optimistic thoughts and goals. Remember, you become what you think about most. Lastly, Exercise mental strength regularly. Just like a muscle, your mindset needs to be trained and strengthened. Practice resilience, optimism, and emotional intelligence. This will help you navigate through life's challenges and set you up for success. In essence, fostering a supportive mindset is about cultivating attitudes and habits that propel you towards your goals. It's about believing in yourself, staying positive, and never giving up. Chapter 23. Leaving a Legacy of Positive Thought As you journey towards success, cultivating a legacy of positive thought is your next powerful step. This isn't about mere positivity, but about creating an enduring impact with your thought process. It's about shaping the world around you with the power of your thoughts. When you harbor positive thoughts, you're more likely to inspire positivity in others. Your thoughts aren't just for you, they're a gift you can share with the world. Consider the people who've made an impact in your life, those whose words and ideas continue to inspire you. They've created a legacy that extends beyond their own life's journey, and you can do the same. Start with your daily thoughts. Are they constructive or destructive? If you find yourself often dwelling on the negatives, take the time to reframe these thoughts. Turn setbacks into learning opportunities failures into stepping stones. This isn't just a feel-good exercise, it's a practical step towards creating a legacy of positive thinking. But it's not enough to change your thinking, you must also act on these thoughts. Let your positive thinking guide your actions, and you'll soon see the changes in your life and the lives of those around you. It's amazing how one positive thought, when acted upon, can create a ripple effect of positivity. You've discovered the secret. The power of thought is truly in your hands. Imagine your dreams as tangible realities, whisper affirmations like sweet promises, banish doubts to the shadows, and let abundance bloom in your mind. Adapt, meditate, focus, and above all, believe. Your supportive mindset is your golden ticket to success. Leave a legacy, not of mere existence, but of radiant positivity. Remember, everything you think can come true. So dare to think big, dare to dream, and dare to live. Thanks for listening to or reading this from Audiobooks Office.